Please welcome three very funny women with important things to say about their own breasts. Comedians Laura Keitlinger, Stephanie Hodge, and Rhonda Shear. I'm excited about having um, other comics. Yeah. So let's just say, let's start out with like, say your breast size. <laughs> um, I'm a D. <laughs> I'm a B, 34B. 34B. 34D. 34D. Proud, paid for, 36D. Yeah. Bought and paid for. That's cool. I suppose I, I don't want to say mine. I, I got like around yours. <laughs> uh, that's like a 38. Yeah. They do keep changing. Do they? And at least, at least you'll know, once you've paid for them, they're not going to go down. But if you eat, they're going to go up. They change. They well, but they could go down. They could go. Mm. It's not like they're going to reduce. Not with what my doctor did. They're industrial strength. Really? These guys are not moving. What did he do? I don't know. I don't ask. Did he put some kind of like a bridge under no, each you know, I have seen some women have those, those nipples, those bullets. I remember Christy Brinkley in 1980. I was, like, I was in junior high school feeling bad about being uh, tall and flat. <laughs> and I remember that it was in this guy, I really liked this guy, and it was in his locker, Christy Brinkley, and I said, why do I live? Because <laughs> I thought like I had it made because, you know, tall and, you know, like flat, like a model, but then models all had big boobs in the 80s. But they got like bigger and bigger, right? Oh, yeah, right? yeah, like supermodels, yeah. Their boobs got huger and huger, but the rest of them got smaller yeah. and smaller. Yeah. It's like a, the ideal woman is a 90-pound anorexic with like right. D-sized breasts. <laughs> what is that about? What does that mean? Everybody wants their mama? <laughs> <laughs> I have no idea. Is that what it means? See, I like the well. Right from the south, so I always had big hair to make, you know, the hips look smaller. That's the whole thing. Is that what that's for? Yeah. Big hair and Southern big girls. Have you ever, you, Miss Texas? I never had a butt until I had a baby. Oh. See, oh, I had well. no hips. And when I, you have the baby, everything goes, well, everything <laughs> <just, it's, laughs> I was huge. 